I am currently working on a seismic retrofit for a guy, for a general that I've been working for for a long time there named Jerry Weintraub. Well, I guess I'll have another beer until he gets here. And Jerry is not happy in the least about what's going on here because we're about two weeks late on this job. Football to me is probably the Cretan sport. We really pushed him back and also we took off last week and went skiing for three days. So we didn't tell him that. We told him we had bronchitis, uh, which he didn't believe because two of us on the crew had it. Why isn't everything rolled out? Uh, the keys oh. are locked in the truck. The keys are in the truck? The keys are locked in the truck. Oh really? The truck's running. And so what? Would I like a beer? Yeah. You, oh, you mean instead of work? You can get into the cans of beer, but you can't get into the truck. It's Jerry, Sunday morning. Has Jerry been by here? Jerry hasn't been here all day. Has he come to see your little beer picnic here? Jerry Why hasn't been here. Why don't you call on the fucking cell phone? What time did you guys get here? We got here at 8. That's eight what we said. 8 o'clock. Eight o'clock. <laughs> Jerry said he'd be here at 8 o'clock. I, I haven't seen, seen Jerry. We've been seeing him since 8 o'clock. the door. You mean Slim Jim? You mean like a piece of sheet metal? Yes. Like like what they manufacture right here? Like what's in that dumpster over there? Long pieces of sheet metal? You guys couldn't cut one up? Oh, we got a cool crew sitting around here. You're not going to break a $25 window on an old piece of shit truck? Are you the foreman around here? Yeah. You're paid to think a little bit. You're paid to think just a little bit. I'm not paying for this bullshit. What do you mean you're not paying for it? We've been here since 8 o'clock. Time starts right now, and we're working through the football game. How do you like that? I don't think so. You are smart enough to get in that truck. We talked about this last night. We're not missing the game. We'll just kick ass and get Let me ask you a question. Are you smart enough to get into a locked truck? How'd you guys get to the liquor store? You walked to the liquor store. No. That one. What are you laughing at? Get a fucking sledgehammer, break the window, and go to work. Sledgehammer's in the truck. Sledgehammer's locked in the truck. Mike, run down here and we're going to take that. Hello? 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 At the top. Hey, now we've got a moment. Raven, show you one of my favorite tricks. Dog drinking a beer. The return of dog drinking a beer. In big demand, everybody. You guys ready? Yes! <laughs> yes! Yes! Yeah. yes. Do it. Yeah. Woo. Right. Get back to work. <laughs> you need another beer, too. Oh, uh, hey, Jerry. Hey, Wes. <laughs> How are you? Sunday afternoon, just having a little bit of fun. Hey, Jerry, what's happening? Kicking ass, though. Just having a beer. Sunday. Not watching the playoff games, though. We are here kicking ass like we said we would. Over the bronchitis. Yeah. Eddie and I. He had a touch of it himself. Yes. Yeah. But, he did. The only guys I know that can catch a tan from bronchitis. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. It is yeah. California. Well, you lay out in the sun, you burn it out, and it's, everything it's like been that. Warm. Yeah, it's been warm. It's been indeed. Warm. So but what, what we are we, here. What was going on this morning? With what? What are you talking about? I thought this was the first time you're here. Uh, no, I, I was here at 8 30. I thought you said he wasn't here at 8.30. Uh, well, I, I, don't, I don't think I saw him. But you don't, did you see him or did you not see him? I talked to him. Oh, really? You know, he kind of looks a little familiar, but... Uh, oh, he looks a little familiar. You've known him for about two years? Smart ass. These guys look like the monkeys, you know, right? 2001, looking at that obelisk. Looking at the truck trying to get in? Yeah. Yeah, except the monkeys figured the whole thing out. It's the only difference. But I thought you didn't see him either. I, I didn't see him. You didn't see him, I didn't but see he was him. here. I didn't see him. You closed your eyes when he came? I, no, I, I was, that's when I was uh, up the street. Oh, but you knew he was here. Oh. I, I didn't see him. I said I didn't right, see him. Right. When's this job going to be Tomorrow night, I promise you. I've been... Hey. Hey, what's going on, Keenan? How are you? Hey, I'm Mike. I'm uh, Wes's brother. What's going on? Yeah. How you doing? Good, we're everything working. Good? Yeah, everything's hey, good. Guys, everything's Why good. are you out here on a How Sunday? Oh, I wanted to talk to Jerry quickly. You did? Yeah. About what? Uh, it's a circus that I'm putting together. I want to try to put together like the most unusual acts that what anyone could do. Like I have a guy who's going to light his balls on fire. I have a guy who's going to kick oh, down the house. What's that got to do with me? Well, I have another guy who's like 6'11". He's an Orthodox Jew, and I thought, you're the only other 6'10 guy that You know, I'm not sure if you're aware of this. He's Jewish also. I don't think he it's wants to kick another Jewish thing. guy's ass. It's not an anti-Semitic thing. It's not like that. The other guy happens to be Jewish, Wes, okay? It's not, it's not a Jewish you're joke. You're looking I'm for like a German guy to kick a Jewish no, guy's ass or no, anything like that? No, it's just lay off. I just want to talk to you two minutes. Can I just talk to you two minutes about it? Okay, well, I'm going to talk to him for two seconds. You know, we got some business here that we got to talk about. Yeah, Wes, two minutes. I'll be back. It's Sunday. Just give me what? 
That is one big Jew. He's a huge Jew, yeah. That is a huge yeah. Jew. I don't, I, don't say, I don't say the tip tippers. He says he's got a bigger Jew. What happens is I got this guy, he's an Orthodox Jew, he's 6'11", and if I got you, it's nothing to do with Jewish, he just happens to be Orthodox. Mm -hmm. and I just want the two, you guys just two going you at You like, I can sort of like, you know. No, 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 no. you don't have I to worry about Jews. Jews. Just just some big time. Yeah, get to work. Cool, man. What, what are you doing here today? <laughs> what do you mean? I'm talking to Jerry. Yeah, I know you're talking to Jerry. I thought we talked about you talking to Jerry. You didn't want me to talk to Jerry, but That's I, right. I just wanted to ask Jerry I if he was you, interested. I told you I didn't think Jerry had any interest in your freak show boxing match. I just match. want to know if he was interested. That's all. Listen, he's interested. He seriously is interested. He, he's interested because you talked him into it, didn't you? <laughs> no. Would you promise him Italian girls or something like that? I, I know what you're up to. You're going you're to tell him you're going to turn him into some type of rock star, no, no, right? No, listen to me. I have a guy who's six foot eleven. And I yeah. want another guy who's yeah, six I know. foot ten. You told, you me. told me. Yeah, but you told me he's done some boxing in high school, and that's just it. Just I just put two and two together. It's not a big deal. A little boxing in high school. The guy's forty-two years old. <laughs> that was twenty-four years ago. You yeah. see the guy? Listen, if I work with him a little bit, I'll be able to work. That's all. Work, it's not a you're problem. You're gonna work with a six foot ten, forty-year-old, forty-two-year-old Jewish guy and yeah. turn him into a boxer. Yeah. And what's the whole comment you're making to him about the German and fighting the Jews? I'm not trying I, to make this. I don't this know what the theme is. What it's is the not theme? Some... Giant fighting Jews? Yeah. You've never seen it before, and that's why I do that. What's the, the point the, of that? The whole point is that you've never seen it before. That's my whole fucking concept and the whole fucking urban circus I, that you don't I, seem to I, take I've seriously. I've never seen you stick a banana up your ass, but I don't want to see that either. You know either. what's up your ass is the fucking chopping block. Because every time I go to Danny, I go to you. Every time I go to you guys, you got some fucking that, attitude about something. That's completely absurd. The whole thing, the urban circus is absurd. What's if you so ask absurd me. about it? Why don't you it? tell me the truth about the whole thing? You come out here because you want to get my shit. I told you to stay out of my shit. If you want to be honest with me, tell you, tell me about the chopping block. Tell me about what I said about you and Ruth, about you yes, entering the it's six, years, it's six months ago. Why do I? Why would I give a shit about what you yeah, said the, six months the, ago? You know, you the still thing think about it I, is I probably know you better than you would know yourself, no, but, and I know what you're up to at the whole thing. You can't confront me directly, so you give me this why bullshit. Why would I have a problem with confronting you? Do you think I still took the chopping block? Is that what you think? If, you know, Jerry Weintraub gets Just tell in me, your do you still backyard, think I took the chopping back, block? backyard wrestling thing that you're doing and gets his ass kicked. He's gonna fire me and sue you. You yes. know that? I already talked to Danny. I'm gonna have him sign a release form. I'm gonna have Dave, the other. Right, so he's not going to sue you, but he'll fire me. Why would he fire saying. you? I mean, he's got you he's working on Sunday. Why the fuck would he he's fire gonna you? He's going to fall like a fucking redwood. The guy's no, he's going to fire tall. you for fucking drinking with all your buddies and working on a Sunday. That's what he's going to fire you Sunday afternoon watching a football game. You should be lucky we're out here. Listen, I don't know what to tell you. You know, i got to work a real job, but What's so... your real problem? That's what I want to know. What's your real problem? What's your real problem? No, seriously, what's your real problem? I think you're fucking jealous of my me putting this whole thing together, okay? That's and I actually absurd. can quit, have the balls to quit my job and put something else together and actually make some money at it, get some recognition at it. I'm just trying to do it. Why are you trying I, to fucking interfere with it? I'm just I, trying to fucking I'm, put I'm something together. I'm jealous of you dipping midgets in chocolate or whatever the hell you're doing. Well, what's your problem with it? Why does it concern you so much? Because, Why if Jerry signs a release form... Because you're Shit, man. It's not. I'm having him sign a release form. What is the big fucking deal? And when he goes and gets his ass kicked and breaks his See, neck. I can't even talk to you because you're not even really listening to what the fuck I'm trying to say. I, got things to I do. want to know what the real issue is. I got a real job to work. You know what? You know? You're a king of the nuts. Want to talk about king who the of, fucking king of the nuts? King of the nuts. No, no, you're a king of the nuts. I don't know why you're so fucking crazy. I'm so hurt. I'm so hurt, especially coming from you. That's a terrible thing to say. King of the nuts. My God. You know what bothers me? Is you just think that this is just some temporary uh, insanity that I'm going through. You're not taking... You, oh, anything. you mean like Galvin St. James, the police photographer crap that you did? No, that's different. Interviewing for a job that's that you different. weren't put under a false it's, name. It's different, okay? I proved to myself that I was capable of anything, okay? Who, what, are you bringing, what are you bringing this shit up? What is it? Everything with you is bringing up shit. Interviewing for a police photographer under a fake Forget name. Forget it, okay? I want to know what the problem Raven, is. you got the cameras rolling? My brother's having a nervous breakdown right I'm not here. I hope you document breakdown. it. Maybe you can sell it to well, someone. Like, why? Because I'm doing something that I really believe in. Why is that place? a nervous breakdown? You're the one who's fucking stuck Making in this job. Maybe you're the one with the nervous your breakdown. Job and doing this crap. Guy lighting his balls on fire. Nobody's gonna pay to see that shit except Wait, a bunch of 14-year-old kids. I don't have to listen to shit. No, you guys I don't. Stop. If you got something to really fucking Just say, don't say it. I'm not in your shit. Okay? I told you I'm getting a release form from him. So fucking let it go.